hot topic, sex. How much is too much? And this is even a real question we're going to find out. Welcome, my name is Erica Angelo, and I am your trusted dating and relationship expert. I've been working with men for over 12 years now, it's a long ass time. And one of the favorite topics that you guys like to talk about is sex. And so which presents a very valid question. Can there be too much sex? Well, obviously yes, and obviously no, and I'm really gonna confuse you. So if you're new here, make sure that you subscribe and you turn on the notification bell because I am known to throw curveballs and do really out of the box live videos here on YouTube. And it's my way to connect with you guys to answer your questions in real time about real topics that really resonate with you guys, like things that you need answers on and you need answers right away. So make sure you subscribe and turn on that notification bell. Listen, when it comes to sex, like every individual is completely different. But when sex becomes too much is when we are using sex to fill a void. What do I mean by that? This is why people become sex addicts and have to go to actual therapy for this. When there's a void or when there's trauma in our life that we are trying to avoid, we're trying to distract. And so we try to medicate ourselves through excessive sex, that's when sex becomes a problem. Because at the end of the day, there is a wound inside that we're not addressing. There's a traumatic experience that we're not willing to face. And so what happens is we end up having lots of meaningless sex that actually never fulfills. It never actually scratches that itch. So yes, sometimes when we're trying to avoid life's bigger problems, the shadows that lurk in the background that are, are tormenting us, sex can be too much because we're using it as a distraction and it's actually meant to be a very beautiful and holy thing that can bring healing to our bodies, that brings pleasure to our bodies, that realigns and recalibrates our bodies back to joy and bliss, which is the God-given state that we're all meant to live in. Now, there also is the opposite extreme of too little sex when men's sex drives kind of hit a plateau or my guys who are very in their head and very analytical. You could be watching this video and thinking, yes, please validate why I don't have sex as much. And I'm actually not gonna validate you in that because a lot of guys get mental blocks, they get into their heads, they're very performance-based, uh, they're very career-oriented, and because their minds constantly spend with this analytical information, it cuts, it cuts them off from their penis, essentially, and so they're not able to perform. They have premature ejaculation. And they can't keep it up. And so that's also the same dilemma. It's an issue that's going on inside that it's an internal problem that needs to be addressed. But look, at the end of the day, sex is meant to return us to our bodies. It's, it's meant to return us to bliss. It's meant to bring pleasure into our lives. And so that when we talk about pleasure, it's like, can I go to the ocean too much? No, as long as you're not running away from something or avoiding a problem, sex is a beautiful thing. Some couples can have sex up to three times every day and that's beautiful. It all depends on where you are. But if there's an area of trauma or something that you're not addressing and you're using sex as a tool to distract you, that is when it becomes unhealthy. That's when it becomes too much. Listen, if this is a really difficult topic for you, make sure that you reach out to me, schedule a call with me. I'll put a link in the comment section below that says work with me, schedule a call with me. I'd love to be able to support you through this and see, you know, do you have a sexual addiction? Is this something that can be worked through? Or if you're one of those guys, you're like, I have performance issues, Erica, I need help. I get two in my head, then make sure that you reach out to me. Guys, listen, this is the most important thing. You need to know that at the end of the day, you have what it takes. I'm just here to be your guide, to bring you back to yourself, to remind you that you are loved, that you are powerful, that you're safe, and that you can do it. You have what it takes. And in this very moment, my dear, you are already loved. So tell me in the comments section below, do you think 
that there can be too much sex. I'm very curious to hear what your thoughts are around this. So I will meet you in that comment section. Don't forget to check out that link to work with me. I'd love to be able to support you in this. I will see you guys in my next video. You take care.